The biggest post draft event in the history of 2K, 100 grand on the line, 50 more from last year with the time we did it in Vegas. An unbelievable tournament. It's just so, so much fun. Over 50 teams competing, 40 on the 5v5 side, 10 plus on the 3v3 side. So much talent. I think that is definitely the most important part about this. I feel like it's a, it's a chance to get your name out there, you know what I'm saying? In case you know, nobody knows you. You win a, you win a pro -M event, a unified pro -M event, a lot of people know you, you know what I'm saying? It's all about connections and getting your name on. The Unified Film just is a place where you can, you know, just showcase your skills and you meet people, and you meet people, and it's that fun. Start at the top. Let's start on Saturday. We had so many teams competing this time around, thinking that this was going to be their time, thinking that this was going to be their tournament, and unfortunately, the best talent ended up reigning supreme. I mentioned Eyeball Greens. Him and that Empire Gaming team, they started as the 14 seed. They make an incredible run, win two rounds, but then they run into team execution, led by Eyeball Spam, Eyeball Benzo, King Peroxide, already won a belt back in Dallas last year, and they took them down to the Xbox side. What, what a run for Team about? Execution. I've never really seen anything like that spam benzo combination. Now on the PlayStation side, man, we gotta talk about fear potential. Green light trying to get back in the lead. Antoine Love, the number one ranked player in the UPA, making some incredible shots all tournament long. Really, really impressed by them. Taking down a very good build for this team midway through the tournament. That was really special. That's on the right side of the bracket. On the left side of the bracket, it's defined by one team and one team only. One of the best up and coming brands in all of 2K, Zero Gaming. Led by our breakout star the real Tay, him and U-Bots going back and forth, an incredible duo, Flacco and Willow Sauce down low, just a great, great team. Of course, you have Mr. Hom at the middle there in the lock. Just a great team, the Cinderella run, they take down the number one seed, no respect in the semifinal, they take down the number two seed in the final fear, as I talked about, and they win the PS5 title as a four seed. Incredible stuff, incredible run for Zero Gaming. They were a really, really special group. Shout out to him, especially their coach, Big Face Lock. He started making an for himself in this tournament. And of course, we get to the final four. That's some incredible right matchups. Firesticks Gaming taking on that team execution on the Xbox side and on the PlayStation side. Fear potential in Zero Gaming, oh like God. I talked about. It all bad. came yeah. down to a couple of shots here and there. Couple back and forth. It was the real Tay again, dropping them when he needed to, taking down that fear potential team for that team execution. Man, oh man, they were just too good. Too much talent, too much two way ability. Benzo with the steals and the scores, spam control, never turning it over, always knows what to do. The clutch man himself. We have five guys, all with league talent. I can't wait to see how they do in their future.